Wow. Okay, that was wonderful. Teleported into the bog. We didn't even get a chance to freaking breathe because we just got jumped by a bunch of ants. It sounded like there was more than like the standard four of them. Because those bastards ate us alive. What is with... What is up, ladies and gentlemen? CJ the Cheese DJ here. And we are back with a brand new Genesis video for you guys today. And today, guys, we are starting our Genesis playthrough. Dun dun dun. So guys, we do have a PC server available as well as some PS4 servers available. If you guys want to check them out, head to the Discord. If you want to host your own, we've got a link in the description. That will take you to Nitrado where you can get another server. What we're going to do real quick here though is we are just going to fix up the bloom quality and the gamma. Alrighty, well, I'm already a fan of the bog. It's dark, it's gloomy, and it's raining. I absolutely hate the rain in this game. It looks like heavy milk. So, uh, so far we're off to a great start. So guys, as you are aware, Genesis is a very, uh, mission-based, mission, yeah, mission-based, uh, DLC, I guess you could call it. Um, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, so real quick, the server settings, we're running two mods. We've got Ultra Stacks and we have the awesome Spyglass mod. Our, um, rates are slightly turned, oh, and the upgrade station as well. Forgot about that. Uh, our rates are slightly turned up, so weight we get times 3, melee damage is times 1.2, movement speed is times 5, stamina is times 2, and oxygen is times 3 as well. Uh, and it's kind of the same sort of stats for the dinos. What is that? Oh, it's a baryonyx. So, yeah, they're the stats for here. Uh, breeding is kind of extremely boosted. As you would expect, gather rates are five times, time rates are five times as well, and XP is times five as well. So there are our rates. Let's get into it now, guys. So first off, I do want to tame up a parasaur because I have heard the bog is an absolute crazy place to be due to the fact that there are these swarms, the blade wasp swarms, and they just apparently never leave you alone, but the parasaurs can scare them off. What do you want, bitty guy? Prime fish meat. So, yeah. But I honestly don't think we'll stay in the bog for too long, to be honest, because I'm not a fan of it. Uh, my favorite biome so far is the ocean. Uh, mainly because that's the actual only place that has decent weather. Like, it's actually sunny and you can see what you're doing. That's, that's why. That is the pure reason why. I am a fan of the ocean other than all the other biomes. And it looks like these plants just give you straight up narco berries too, by the looks of it. Yeah, they do too. So right now we're just grabbing a few levels, trying to get some seeds, some berries. Uh, Helena, how does this work? Let's, I've, I've played around with it very briefly in between like making videos and whatnot. Okay, so we're in the bog biome. So I guess this gives us an overview of where the missions are. How far away they are from you? Can you track them? Oh, you can. Okay, so you can also track the missions. Okay, so we're not going to do that. Mound over matter, bog biome, ocean biome, volcanic biome, and lunar biome. All right. Bulb dog. Bulb dog boar. Pick up game. Two minutes, five minutes. Okay. Don't fear the Reaper King. Sure. Space Jam. Where do you get the bulb dog from? That's what I want to know. Okay, so you've got like lots of... Um... Different sort of uh, missions here, but it looks like they're the same sort of thing. Take it down and reclaim the stars. Oh, damn. All right. So we do want to grab some hexagons because that's how we get cryopods and all the extra materials. That's a date on. That'll eat us alive. Oh, God. He's found us. He's onto us. Uh, I don't know if we can out. Oh god, damn that hits hard. Uh, Kentros, they're not gonna aggro on him. Let's just let's just run away. Hey, Stego, mate, you wanna you wanna take the? Oh god, we're dead. Wait, oh, the Stego gods. Oh, that's fancy. I'm honestly tempted to just go straight to the ocean, to be honest. All right, uh, let's let's come back here. How many levels did we actually get from that? Because I do want to get a parasaur. Uh, we got a couple more in weight. We also have auto loan on as well. Uh, so that's going to help us learn all the stuff. 
you know what? I'm honestly tempted to just go straight to the ocean. Or even the... Even the snow, because we spawned in there when we first started playing, and... Oh, look, our bag's just over here. And we got, like, a whole bunch of the glitches, um, which gave us the hexagons. So that was really good. Come on, Stego, kill this Daydon for us, mate. Relying on you here. But, um, other than that, my interactions with Genesis haven't been too enjoyable. Honestly, not the biggest fan of the DLC. I know a lot of you guys are feeling the same. It's just... I don't know, it's lacking. Like, the biomes aren't all that big. You can't build in the mission areas unless you watch that latest video that I did where uh, it shows you how to build in them. But, you know, other than that, there's not really... Oh, I don't want to get hit here. Other than that, there's not really much else going for it, to be honest. The new dinos are pretty cool, but there's only four of them. Four. Uh, which is pretty crappy, if you ask me. So, yeah, I'm not sure how I'm feeling about it. Um... Some chasing us. Oh, that's a raptor. Oh, shit, we're dead. It's going to grapple us for sure. There's no way we're going to outrun it with our little legs. Okay, it got distracted. That's fine with us. We're going to come over here. So far, so good. I'm uh, I'm thinking we're doing all right in the bog so far. Uh, I'm going to go movement speed. I don't remember how much I pumped. 107.5. Okay, that's pretty good. All right. Oh, God. We need to make some bowlers. And possibly a slingshot. Is he after us again? He's not after us. Okay. So, let's get our basic tools going. Uh, I wonder if that Daydon is dead. I can hear something. What is it? We're going to take a second here to turn up our special effects. Because I can't quite hear anything. And that one. Okay. Let's see if that works. And we're going to go and craft... Oh. We need some thatch and wood. That would probably help. I th honestly am tempted to just get out of here, though. Like, I think we just might go to the ocean. Because it's a lot friendlier over there. And uh, things aren't trying to kill us constantly. Alright, that should be enough. Let's go you. Why do I have two stone picks? And two hatchets. That's weird. Um, Yeah. We were going to put S plus on the uh, server as well. But... We decided not to yet because a lot of the mods haven't been patched for Genesis yet. So I don't really want to break the mod and I do want to get some of this gameplay out to you guys ASAP because we've been literally covering everything else except us actually going through the uh, through the DLC. So we're just grabbing a bit of flint here. Uh, I need to try and find a body so we can get some hide and make a bowler. Oh god. Are they just a Titan Menina? Yeah, it's just a Titan Menina. Let's get away. Famous last words, it's just a Titan Menina. Where is it? There it is. Freaking, I hate these things. Don't tell me, it's going to kill us. How strong did I make the dinos? I may have made dinos stronger. Alright, so we killed him. Oh, shit. His friends are here. Oh, and there's another one. Shut up, Helena. You're not helping here. Okay, well, that was a waste of time. Yeah, I'm thinking we, uh... I'm thinking we go over to the ocean, or at least the snow. The snow, I found some glitches that would enable us to actually get some hexagons. I did just see another glitch over there, but I'm pretty sure our body was over here somewhere. Where we died, anyway. Is there anything here? No? I don't know where our body's gone. Looks like we're back to square one. Oh, yes, I missed the, uh... The basic starters of good old Ark. Oh, there's our body. Okay, we'll come back for it. We know where it is. There's a bunch of Iguanodons and Stegos over here. And a bunch of Titan Minions as well. Wonderful. So, oh, that's a Blade Wasp swarm and a half. Are they going to try and kill us? Normally it says a Blade Wasp swarm is on you or something. Just from my, uh... Yeah, here we go. Insect swarm. Apparently if we go in the water... Oh, we're out of stamina. You guys are going to try and eat me now? No, it doesn't look like it. Alright, sweet. So, let's chuck this extra level in that we got. I'm going to go... Oh, never mind. They ate us. Half ate us. Alrighty, guys. So, we're back. Uh, no luck in the bog biome whatsoever. So, we're here in the Arctic biome to try and get some hexagons. Because hexagons make the world go round. 
There's a bunch of saber-toothed salmon in here. Hopefully we don't accidentally punch them. Oh my god, this would be a pristine place to go fishing, though. God damn. Alright, so we're going to start fixing up some of these... Oh, Jesus, we're already dead. From the freaking ice. That didn't take long at all. Alright, maybe because it's night time. Alright, well, we just got a hundred... Uh, sorry, thousand hexagons, but we're about to die anyway. And we got double XP, but we're about to... <laughs> oh, rip. Okay. That was a uh, swell job there, CJ. I probably shouldn't hang around here because we're just going to go back into the same situation. Our health is rapidly declining. And uh, that's going to result in us rapidly declining down the food chain. And it's night time. I freaking hate night time. Can we get up here? All right. Maybe we'll just skip the ice biome. We'll skip the bog biome. We'll just go straight to space, hey. We're just gonna we're gonna bypass all of that and go straight to space and just try and live it out on space. <laughs> I'm gonna get real tired of Helena, especially with the amount of dying I do. Let's go volcanic. We're going volcanic. I reckon we can survive in volcanic. I don't think the volcanic area is that hard as long as we uh, maintain our distance from everything that's trying to kill us. We should be right. And I stand corrected. These freaking ants are back again. They're just ants are trying to kill us all. Alright, so are you... No, you're just a normal parasaur. Are they still trying to get us? No. Alright, so the big scary magma saws are over there in the distance. That's, uh... And the aloes. And I think they see us. We're going to try and run the opposite direction so that uh, we have nothing to do with them. Hey, look, some water and a glitch over there. Let's go fix the glitch. If we can fix that glitch, we, uh... Should be able to get the double XP, and then we can hopefully try and uh, work our way up towards the higher levels. Oh god, this is going to be terrifying to navigate. Please don't die. Maybe I should get a little bit more health before we uh, continue. Oh, I have 10 levels. Oh, mad. The glitches give you mad amounts of level. Alright, so I'm going to wait for all that to go away. Maybe I should buff the health as well, because we only get 10 per stack, which is a little bit annoying, but I mean, eh. I'm not too bothered by it all that much. Alright, let's, 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 let's just... Hey, look, this looks like a nice easy way to get down the mountainside. Look at that. Look at that. No prob... Oh, crap. Whatsoever. No problems. Awesome. Alrighty. So, oh god, that's an exploding geyser. Oh, we're taking poison damage. Oh god. Gas burst, suffocating. Ah, uh, yeah, we're dead. Concentrate. You got this. Well, I am definitely already sick of freaking Helena and her loud mouth. Let's let's try this one more time. So I don't know what actual dinos spawn here. It looks like there's an iguanodon, huh? I didn't think these guys would spawn in the volcanic area. We've got some Kentros. You've obviously got the volcanic variants. There's Argies here, which is extremely dumb and infuriating. Considering that uh, you can't actually... You can tame them, but you can't fly around with them, which is so dumb. Actually, I think on our server we sh have changed that, so you can actually fly around on them. Let's come over to this glitch. We're going to give this one more shot. If it doesn't work out, we are going to go back to the ocean. There's the big old scary T-Rex over there. And we got some scorpions, some some trikes, just run away from the scorpion. Thorny dragon. Oh, of course we run out of stamina. Come on, come on, come on. We just need to fix this glitch. We fix this glitch, we get a few levels. Helena, make yourself useful. Fix the glitch. Okay, she fixed it. Okay. You're on your own. Well, you've got me, of course, after it comes to something. Okay. So, we've got a bit of double XP here. This is our chance to sort of craft some stuff up. I haven't seen... Oh, there are the trees. What are you running from, Mr. Galley? You just stay right there, buddy. We'll help you out. We'll get you right out of there. There's a Rex over there. Uh, we're not going to kill you for your hide. I promise, mate. You just have to sit back, relax, and let us take care of you. I promise everything will be okay, mate. Just, just stop trying to run away. Alright, we're going to get a bit of flint here. 
going to make a little bit of a basic tooling. That Rex is getting very close. It's making me very uncomfortable because there is two of them. Are we learning them twice? No, we're not. I'm going to make those. I'm going to make enough stuff for a bow. We're going to kill this galley so we can get some hide. Oh, hello. What are you flashing green for? That was weird. Um, okay, chuck that in there. Those Rexes are getting very close. We should probably teleport away before they uh, come any closer to us. Let's do that. We might actually teleport back to the bog biome, to be honest. I might try and tame up a, a Baryonyx, because if we get a Baryonyx, we can pretty much search through most of the ocean biome, or even a Capra. I wouldn't mind either of those. Uh, I need a bow. I need some more arrows. Where are the arrows at? There we go. And we got another level. We'll chuck it into health. Alright, put that bad boy there. Let's go. We can kill this galley. Get a little bit of extra XP because it's double XP. Don't you try and run away, mate. Just stay right there. I can't bowler him because I've got no hide, so this is our hide source. Oh, God. He went flying. Alright. Oh, hello, Mr. Jugbug. Thank you for the water. Alright, give us that juicy hide. Come on. Give us some. 66, 78, 88. Oh, yeah. We're getting a decent amount of hide. Okay, we're getting a lot of hide. I'll take that. Oh, Jesus. That's not a friendly creature. <laughs> what is going on up here? Has this scorpion knocked everything out? No, it's just all dead. Why isn't he not eating it? Dimitrodon, mate. Were you the one that stopped the scorpion? I don't want to piss you off. Alright, they're stuck on the corpse. That's fine, we'll just harvest that up. I've got 23 arrows. I don't know how many I need to take on this scorpion. I don't know what level he is. I'm going to get a little bit more flint. I don't really want to die because we've got a, quite a bit of hide now. And uh, in the early game, hide is uh, totally worth it. We've got the hexagons as well though, which we can use. Uh, we've got a few of those. But I might just try crafting up some more arrows while we've got this uh, extra XP. That thorny dragon was only level 20. Uh, so he should be hand handable. Is that a word? Yeah. I'm gonna just punch this tree. Alright, let's make a few arrows. Alright, we've got 30 arrows crafting back up. Those Rexes are very close to where we were before. I'm gonna try taking on this scorpion. I'm gonna wait till we're a little bit closer, so just in case we can run away. He's aggroed on us now. Let's try and take him on. Hey, big guy. I don't... I really hope... Oh, God. I really hope he's not a high level. And uh, we don't run into anything dangerous. I could have just made a bowler, actually. I didn't even think about that. Noob, mis noob mistakes. All right. Let's kill this guy. He's running away from us now, which means he's almost dead. Oh, look. They haven't fixed the hitbox yet. Wonderful. All right. Dead. Awesome. Let's get a bit of kite in here. And some extra meat. That Rex. Jesus. They ain't holding back. They're coming out here as soon as possible. Look at them go. And uh, that Magmasaur is uh, getting pretty close as well. We're going to run the opposite direction away from them. Because I really don't want a piece of them. Get a little bit of water in our systems. Get some more wood. Alright, I'm thinking we're done here for now. I'm thinking we want to go. Hey, Mr. Listrosaurus. You're looking mighty peaceful there, mate. Be a shame if someone put an arrow in your head. Oh, you're a tough little boy, are you? We're going to have to use more than one arrow. There we go. He's dead. Sweet. All right. Kill that. We've got a little stockpile of hide now, which is pretty good. We're going to try and get some of this metal out of here, though. Uh, main reason, because we're going to need metal eventually. And I think we're at that stage where we should be able to make some metal stuff. Uh, so we need as much metal as we can to make a smithy. Uh, this should give us a decent amount. This should give us what we need to make the smithy. And a pickaxe, hopefully. Cool, that broke. Let's get our levels going while that's going. Uh, I'm going to go and do that. And do that. Okay. Yeah, so we're up to metal now. Sweet. Alright, so I'm thinking we get a tame now. Don't know if we want to go for a, an Iguanodon or one of those, or a Parasaur, or like just skip those and go straight for like a Barry. Or a Capro. We did see them in the bog. I think I want to get like a chest down or something. Actually, what missions are nearby, Helena? I don't think we can actually do anything at the moment in terms of missions because we don't have any... 
Uh, yeah. Dead Heat, Ride a Skittish Galley. See, I don't know if we need to bring our own galley to this. Or what? We're going to track it. I don't know how it'll work. Okay, so it pops up on the screen like that. I'm going to track it because I want to see if we actually need to bring our own galley or... If one gets given to us, there's something around here that's, uh, that's yelling at us. Grab a bit of metal and stone. Now, you're probably wondering why things aren't weighing so much because we've got ultra stacks on. Looking at it, though, I think I might turn it off. Uh, seems like it might be a little bit too OP for the playthrough. Uh, Primal Fear and stuff like that, it's fine. But I think for this, we might have to take it off the server. Because, uh, yeah, I don't want to be, like, too OP. And we're carrying all this weight, and it's barely weighing anything on us. All right. That should be enough metal. Let's go see this mission. Let's find out what this is about. If we have to bring our own dude, or, like, what? That's a thorny dragon. He sees us. Hey, mate. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just passing through your area. Oh, God. There's some spines. Crap. Please don't trade me too hard. Jesus Christ. These guys are fast. Uh, run the opposite direction. Oh, God. There's some T-Rexes over there. Oh, we killed him. Oh, that was easy. They're not they're not coming over here right now. Good. Alright, grab some more hide. Awesome. Oh, uh, I think we've got enough stuff to get a base going, to be honest. We've got plenty of stone. We've got enough hide. We've got some small amounts of metal. We've got some keratin now, which should enable us to get some. We could set up a little base here, to be honest. I don't know. We're going to have to set these bases up across, like, every biome, to be honest. But I do just want to try and get a tame. Before we head out, we've got an Anki here. What level are you, big guy? 50. This looks like a relatively peaceful area. I kind of just want to skip everything and go straight for a Magmasaur, though, to be honest. Because, uh, yeah, I want to run in and get those eggs. Dead heat, 725 meters. Okay. What level are you, Trikes? You guys aren't hostile, are you? 50, 45... 15. I'm going to go for this Iguanodon. Uh, don't have enough berries. We're going to go for the Iguanodon because we're in an area full of trikes. If we attack one trike, all trikes will get angry at us and try to kill us. So let's go that. We want movement speed. I'll go one more of movement speed. Alrighty. We're going to build a little setup here just with like a, a mortar and pestle and stuff. Do we have any spoiled meat? Spoil time is in three minutes, so we're going to get some berries, gather some of that up. I think we'll put a base over here. Uh, I should be able to build a stone foundation. There it is. Awesome. Give me that. And we want a mortar and pestle as well. Uh, yeah, so we'll get all this stuff set up and we'll bring you guys back when uh, hopefully we've got enough stuff to tame up an Iguanodon boy. Alrighty guys, so uh, that Iguanodon we were going to tame up. Yeah, he, uh, he ran down and tried to take on the uh, Magmasaur because they've got a taunt thing. And if they use it, literally everything in the area just loses all semblance of itself and just goes ballistic and attacks it. So I don't think we'll be taming up that Iguanodon. So now I'm a little bit at a loss of what to do. So we're kind of just surveying the area at the moment. I don't know how much health that Magmasaur has. I think both Iguanodons are still alive. There's a Parasaur there. I don't think we want a Parasaur though. I think we do want to get an Iguanodon. Could just bypass the entire food chain and go straight for a T-Rex. Uh, that Magmasaur is probably destroying all those guys down there though. Let's go one of those and one of those. And yeah, I don't think... They're all dead, for sure. They're all dead. There's a dead Iguanodon. Alright, I'm going to go down there and capitalize on this. And we're going to harvest some of the corpses for a bit of hide. Because more hide means uh, more gains. And uh, I think we might transfer back to the bog. And try and tame up something over there. Because, yeah. Everything over here is trying to kill us. Including the Magmasaurs. So, I, what level is this trike? Maybe we can get this trike. Because uh, this one is kind of solitary. But that Magmasaur is just there. And I can see him. He's taunting us. He's like, I'm coming to get you. But I'm skirting the outside of this. So I don't give you any sort of warning. And then I'm just going to jump on you. So I think what we'll do is we'll grab what we have. And then get out of here. Because 
I don't really want to risk it. Alrighty, so we got 167 spoiled meat. We're going to demolish that. And we're going to demolish that because we can't pick them up because we're not running with the mod. Helena, can you teleport us to... Oh, I don't know. Let's go to the... Oh, do we want to go to the bog? I don't have any narcotics made up yet. Let's, let's go to the ocean. And then we'll make our way to the bog to tame something. And then we'll probably wrap up the video. Because if we go to the ocean, we find a glitch... We can get double XP and we can uh, make all the narcotics and then we can go tame something. Alrighty guys, so we made it to the ocean. Uh, a little bit terrified. I don't want to jump in the water. Uh, we could teleport around and see what's going on. But I don't think I want to do that either. Chasing the white whale. Follow the checkpoints to your target. A white leads to the kiss. You might need more than just a harpoon. Search the ocean depths for a ravenous plesiosaur. Oh, they're all pretty far away. Okay. Uh, so I'm not seeing any glitches, which is what we were kind of counting on. This is a very dense area. And there's not really many tames over here either. Uh, 25. I don't know if we can fly with him. Can we... All right. Let's... let's I'm going to try and tame this dude up. Uh, duh, 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 we want that. And we want a mortar. We're going to get all this stuff going, guys. And, uh, yeah, we'll bring you guys back, hopefully, when we can uh, tame this dude up. Lol, jokes. He totally just flew away from us. Okay, so we're at the barrier here. Yeah, this is tough. I don't know what we're going to do. Because I, one thing I don't like about the ocean biome is that it's all very small, dense islands. And you can't really do much on them in terms of, like, building and stuff. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Let's come down here. Now we're stuck. Great. We are totally stuck in here. No, we're sweet. Okay. Um, yeah, I reckon this should be the bloody starting biome, to be honest. I'm not seeing any glitches, though, which is what we were kind of counting on. All right. Let's get some stuff going, and we're going to get a tame going, because, yeah, we need to tame something. Otherwise, we're going to be here till forever trying to figure out where we're going to build and stuff. Alrighty guys, and uh, we're about to get our first tank. This little dude right here, the Archaeopteryx. So, uh, he's not anything special, but I mean, he will come in handy later down the line. That's if we can even get him knocked out, mind you. So, these guys pretty much have Kaiden as Kibble, and we've got a little bit of Kaiden, and he kind of just stumbled onto the foundation. So I was like, let's shoot a couple of arrows into your head and uh, see if we can tame you up, mate. Okay, we are struggling here. Let's get some more of these bad boys gone. Well, that was a waste of train carries. He's going to run off the edge, aren't you? All right, bye, mate. Bye. Uh, that was a complete fail and a waste of uh, some good old-fashioned narcotics. So we've got the refining forge going. We're trying to get some metal smelted up so we can build a smithy. So we can kind of get into some metal tools before we head back to the bog. Maybe even into some chitin armor or something like that. I don't know if we're high enough level just yet. Uh, but it's a pretty decent start if we can do that. But, well, actually, let's take a look at you. Hold on. Say hello. That'll give us an extra 300. Let's exchange. What can we get from you? We can get 25 chitin for 60. How much have we got? 2,300. Damn, those are cheap. Um, all right. What do we want to grab? Thatch, wood, silica, element, crystal, fiber. I don't know if I need any of that. Oh, wait. You can get metal ingots. Five for 500. So, okay. Give me five of those. So, why are you so happy about that? What are you doing with the hexagons, you weirdo? So, what do we need for a smithy? Some stone and some wood. Oh, yeah, because we put all our wood in the forge. Let's just go like this. Grab some more wood here. I don't know why we ran out of stone for. We had literal tons of it. Where is it? Here we go. Grab some stone as well. Alrighty, well, uh, we've got ourselves a smithy. That was relatively easy. Can I? So it looks like you can only get like resources and then like cryopods. It's a good thing you kind of can't buy tools as well, because I think that would be way too broken if you could get tools from Helena. Um, I mean, I, th I still think it's kind of silly that we have to use Helena as like a middleman 
if you can't find resources. Because like I said, I haven't been able to find any sort of silica pearls on the map. And I have doven, diven, driven, dived, 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 yeah. Dived to like the depths of the ocean and still like nothing. Alright, so let's come in here. Let's grab what's that. Uh, we'll grab all of that and we'll just split it in half. Can I, can I take that please? Thank you. Split in half. And then split in half. And then you can have that back. Alright, sweet. We'll go in here and uh, chuck that in. Chuck that in. Chuck that in. We're going to need stone, fiber, hide, thatch, and the chitin. What have we got? Uh, weapons. Melee. We want one of those. Oh, I need more metal ingots. What was that? Something just flew overhead. It was a little bit scary. Please don't be a bloody Ichthornis. I hate those things. The ones that take your items. All right. Uh, so we got the hat. We got the pickaxe. Weapons ranged. What do we need for that? We get one of those. Helena, come here. I'm gonna swap to another one of those. Day. Give me some yeah, of that. Survivor. Sweet. All right. So we'll chuck this in just to speed things up a little bit, and that'll enable us to get a hatchet. No, never mind. Primitive. What's in that? Primitive melee. Oh, the sword. All right. So. We've got a pickaxe, we've got a crossbow, we've got a couple of bowlers. I might make some more bowlers while we wait. What do we need? All that stuff. I'm going to make four of them. And then we'll chuck the rest in to the smithy. We've got a couple of more metal ingots crafted up. Let's get that done. Uh, narcotics, how are we looking for those? How many did we actually make? nine and we can make one more but we've got four trank arrows so we've got 16 tranks so if we find a low level dino we could tame it up but uh yeah it needs to be a low level dino let's chuck all that in and we'll go weapons and make that bad boy up awesome we're also going to need a bed uh one thing i miss about the s plus is being able to bloody Get everything dragged into your inventory. Made life so much easier. Fiber hide thatch wood. Fiber hide thatch and wood. I literally did that in the most backwards way. All right, let's grab that out. Oh yeah, now we're talking. All right, sweet. Let's get a bed down because if we want to, if we die, I do want to come back here. But I think for now, that is. Probably everything we're going to need for the time being. Uh, what we might do is... I'll chuck some of these berries in here. Uh, and that. And that. And we'll hold on to... We'll split that in half. Take that with us. That can go in there. That can stay. That can go in there. That can go in there. And yeah. I think what we'll do is we'll try and... We'll try and take the necessity. So we can afford the stuff that we lose. Alright. Alright. Let's go with some more tranks. I should get a Herbie first. I think we're going to get a Herbie first. All right, let's teleport me, please, to the bog. We're going to go east this time. Wow. Okay, that was wonderful. Teleported into the bog. We didn't even get a chance to freaking breathe because we just got jumped by a bunch of ants. It sounded like there was more than, like, the standard four of them because those bastards ate us alive. What is with the screen? All right, here we got the lag. I can see our body. Right on, right on target, speaks for yourself. All right, there's a Barry, there's an Iguanodon. I want to try and circumvent these Titan Maninas. Let's get over here, because we're going to run out of stamina real quick. There we go. And there's a Dillo guarding our body now, wonderful. And there's more of them. Why are there so many of these damn ants? We're just going to stand in here for a second. It should deter him from coming into us while we regenerate some stam. Alright. Those damn things. I should have crafted a pike. Alright, let's get a little bit of a surroundings. There's an iguanodon over there. We should tame up a herbie first so we can get more narco berries. There's another iguanodon over there as well. So there's two iguanodons. They must be fighting like a barry or something. Alright, I think we're good. We should be able to get back into our body. Oops, bloody hell. You guys see them all? Look at all the freaking suckers. Let's get into the water. Get into the water. Come on, if we can get in the water, we survive. Alright, we should be okay. Bloody hell. 
There were so many of them. All right, uh, let's chow down on some of these Tinto berries, try and get some health back. It's going to be a damn while before we get any health back. We're just going to stand in the water here for like a solid second while we wait for our health to regenerate because there's no way we're going to be leaving this, this water um, and getting into like anything. Any Running across anything will kill us. Alrighty guys, we got a little bit of health. Uh, it's just taking so long to regenerate. So I'm going to chuck a sleeping bag down in the water here. I'm not even going to kill myself. Can I make it? No, nope, I need fiber. Did I not bring all my fiber? My hide? I didn't. Did I bring arrows? There's a couple of dillos we could kill. I might have to do that. Uh, yeah, because I haven't seen any more iguanodons, but there's been dillos that have been thinking about trying to get to us. Where are those damn ants? There's the dillos. There's one over there. Let's go take that one. Where he's away from his friend. Hey, mate. Wow, CJ, how do you... Oh, Jesus! That's a freaking Capro, of course. Be more careful! God, be more careful, bitch, please! Shut up! Well, that went swimmingly. That Capro literally spawned on top of us. Are we going to get eaten by ants now? Why couldn't we stop? Why, why can't we be here? Look how peaceful it is with all the herbies. Oh, man. Oh, the freaking ants. These damn ants. And now we're getting targeted by the insect swarms. This is this is going great, guys. Wonderful. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. We're coming back to the east location. I don't know where the Capro is, but he could be a... Oh, there he is. I found him. Yep, I found him. Oh god, uh, 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 what do we do? Don't want to go in the water because he will outswim us for sure. Can we get him over to here to fight the Herbies? He's coming over, god damn. There's a Kano over there, wonderful. Uh, we're going to run the opposite direction here. Get as far away as possible. There's a dead Baryonyx, he would have made a great taming. Alright, we're going to wait for some Stam to come back and then we're going to run back over him. Ha <laughs> ha! Joke! Uh, we're, we're pretty much dead. Well, this this went great. This is this is why I miss the early game of Ark. The fact that you can't choose what section of the biomes you want to spawn in is really dumb as well. You have to rely on Helena to freaking teleport you over there. That's another Capro and a Sarko. Oh god. Alrighty guys, well we're going to wrap up the video here for today. I apologize that we didn't get as much done. It was pretty much just us straight up being murdered for like a solid half an hour. So uh, that's really annoying and dumb, but uh, it is what it is. As for Genesis itself, I'm not the biggest fan of it. A lot of you guys aren't enjoying it as much either. I just, it's, it's missing a lot of things that make arc arc. Which is unfortunate, oh, great. Which is unfortunate, but I mean... There's not much else you can do about it, so yeah, we're going to give it one last shot, see if we can get our body back here. These blade wasps aren't doing anything to us. Will we still be able to teleport? Yeah, we'll just still take damage apparently. Okay. Let's see if we can get our body back. I want to try and tame that Capro up if we can, but he's going to be lurking in the swamps waiting for us. I just know it. Yeah, there he is. Look at him, the smug bloody bastard. And there are piranhas in here, of course there are. Oh my god. Their aggro range seriously needs a nerf. Like, god damn. Alright, uh, I've got no idea how we lose this Capro, to be honest, guys. He's running away. This is our chance, I reckon. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get your, get your body. Wait, that's not even our body. What are we doing? Our body bag's over there, god damn it. We didn't even need to come over here. Oh, I'm so dumb sometimes. Please don't kill me, Mega Piranhas. Please don't kill me, Mega Piranhas. Oh, God, there's a force of them. All right, we're good. We're good. Got to get our body. Run away from the ants. Give me the bag. All right, sweet. So, do we want to go after the Capro? Oh, God damn, time to Meninas. What are our options? Terror Bird, Kano, Capro. I'm definitely going with the Capro on this one, guys. Unless we teleport to a separate section of the bog and try our luck there. Alrighty, guys. Uh, I don't think we made our metal hatchet. Can these ants piss off? They're freaking everywhere. Jesus. I'm just about to bloody harvest something, and I can't because these suckers pop up. 
I don't know if that was the Capro we were looking at earlier or if he's somewhere else. Those ants just drain us of our stamina and then we're stuck. Alright, there we go. What do we got over here? I think that Capro might have gotten killed over there, so... Uh, it's a little bit fortunate for us, but a little bit unfortunate because we were going to tame him. There's nothing over there. I don't want a Parasaur. They're not the best at gathering berries. I would rather like an Iguanodon. Uh, but at this stage, it doesn't look like we're going to have much of a choice. Oh my god! Ants! Please! Why are you everywhere for? I'm pretty sure the bog is honestly the hardest out of a lot of them, to be honest. I think we've died more here than anywhere else so far. Alright, uh, yeah, of course we're tired because we keep getting stamina drained by those stupid ants. Alright, there's a berry over there. I don't know what level he is. Can we make a spyglass? We might be able to make the modded one. Do we need crystal for it? Yeah, we do. What level do you need to be Barry Saddle? Barry... Uh, okay. We're only level 39. I'm going to go for it. Let's do it, guys. If we get it, we get it. If not, well, then we're uh, kind of screwed for the next episode. But hey, it was fun, at least. I don't know. Maybe who depends on your definition of fun. All right, here he comes. I don't know what level he is. Probably should find that out. All right, I hope we got him. Oh, no, we didn't get him. Come on. Oh, all right, guys, we're done for today. <laughs> oh, this is frustrating how we can't get over there from the spawn. But, uh, yeah, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe down below for more. But other than that, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. And I got this song.